Okay, so some of you guys have probably seen this truck before. It's a dirt truck. We run a 5.3 in it with a billet S480 right now. It's just stock bottom in, but we are running micro squirt and we had hurt one of the micro squirts because we have two trucks. So we pulled one of them off the other truck with 80 pound injectors. And we're thinking this because we were running like 80 to 100% injector duty cycle because the 80s just weren't big enough. So we went to 160s and because they're a little lower impedance, it was driving the drivers too hard. And we actually hurt one of the drivers within a couple hours of runtime. So one of the drivers is still working correctly. So what we did is we actually tied into the one driver to ground out this solid state relay. And so one driver is actually driving both banks at the same time. And that it's just a hell of a solid state relay. Um, so far it's idling and running to five grand or so, but I, I guess we'll get it up on the trans break here. We're hoping, uh, we're gonna run MS3 Pro, but there was a race tonight and we heard it last weekend and we decided we wanted to race. So we started working on it Wednesday night and actually we had something wired up wrong. So we filled the cylinders with fuel the truck ended up catching on fire at one point and then we took off early today because we wanted to make this race tonight and so far the truck's running and idling and we've had it up to five grand we haven't had it on the trans breaker launch it yet but we're hoping to run somewhere between probably at least 16 pounds of boost tonight maybe up to 25 and we'll be leaving somewhere between five and six grand and hopefully shifting between seven to 7500 so i guess We'll report back when we have better results, but so far so good. And I'm, I'd be interested in trying, but I would almost bet that if somebody was wanting to take a cheap approach, even though it's probably not right, you could probably drive low impedance injectors with it. So um, I guess later I'll try to post up some idle videos of the truck. And maybe if we make get any good passes in tonight, we'll, we'll post that up and let people know what our results are. So if you're having this issue, it's a, uh, it definitely is a fix, but we'll see how well it acts when we get up to high RPM.